and testing a construction technique at CSU. It could be a new weapon against terrorist attacks. Those stories next. Thanks, Paula. Uh -huh. A company in Colorado has developed a new construction system that could help protect buildings against future terrorist bombings and attacks. The system is being tested at Colorado State University. Northern Newsroom reporter Roger Wolf tells us the testing uses a cannon. In a CSU engineering lab, two researchers prepare to fire a gas cannon. They load it with a big bullet, a 12-foot-long piece of 2x4 lumber. They take aim, fill it with high-pressure nitrogen, and fire. At 100 miles an hour, the projectile bounces off the steel wall they're testing. It makes a dent, but doesn't penetrate. Yeah, it didn't break at the backside. So in general, energy was absorbed, and we would classify the system as passing test. The CSU researchers are testing a wall developed by Barrier Construction Systems of Colorado. It's designed to absorb and dissipate a powerful impact. On the backside, there's no damage at all. So the backside would be the interior of a building. And so this, this survived, this passed the test. This testing is to determine how well the wall can withstand a natural disaster, impact from debris hurled through the air by tornadoes. There's a lot of similarity between uh, trying to protect the wall from a projectile or from an explosive. And after the September 11th attack demonstrated the vulnerability of public buildings, there's an urgent interest in any kind of construction that might provide better protection. If you have a wall that resists this type, it would also resist explosives. The question is, how large are the explosives? And we'd probably have to do some independent tests looking at the explosives itself. The CSU researchers are hoping to win some government grants to continue and expand their tests. Roger Wolf, 9 News, Northern Newsroom.